Hey everyone, I'm Chef Rahil from Restaurant Club. We are here in Moncton, New Brunswick, and we're gonna do a little foodie tourism around the city today. Well, we're, uh, we're a small outfit. Yeah, we're a sort of a local corner bakery. So you make your uh, puff pastry uh, all in-house? Yeah, we do everything from scratch on all the items. We come between midnight and three o'clock in the morning. And so by 7 a.m., we're almost ready. And then we start today for what we'll need tomorrow. I held you, you didn't say which one you wanted. The croissant or the, the schneck? Atta boy. It's actually the real name in Germany for schnecki, for snail. We couldn't, in, in, we have shidiak, we have shiak, now we have schnecks. So how many layers do you put in your puff pastry? There's probably a thousand layers. <laughs> thousand layers of love. Uh, our next stop is Centuria. We are here with the uh, chef. So what do you prepared for us today? Pizza night, it's called. Mm -hmm. It's uh, like a flat bread. Mm -hmm. uh, it's an Indian influenced flat bread. Yes. Uh, then uh, when it's come, we have the laksa soup. Mm -hmm. It's very famous in uh, Malaysia. And it's a... Uh, I would say one of my favorite <laughs> two things, you know? Uh, when it's come here, it's a uh, migurung mamak. Okay. It's a Indian flat fried noodles. Mm -hmm. It's a cooked in the wok and it's kind of a fast moving dish here. Oh, perfect. I have seen you cooking that. Well, like, <laughs> it was amazing. Yeah. I'm not going to ask you a secret <laughs> recipe. Yeah. Malaysian food in, in Moncton, Sintaria is the best option you can go for. Here we are in Sidiac. We made a quick stop to try one of the best lobster roll around. There you go. Beautiful. It's beautiful bun, nice lobster. And right now lobster is in the season. And they are just like two minutes away from here where they catch. I come here every time, probably three to four times every summer. I think the lobster roll is the is my first love. Fries, yes, I like it, but it fills you up, right? With uh, lobster roll, you can just have two of them. For the lunch, we went to Shidiak, and now we are here at Houston Park, where there's good food, good vibes, and good drinks. We are here at Houston Park with Chef Natalie. Here we have a steak taco with uh, our horseradish crema and some crispy onions. So what's the inspiration for the Flaming Hot Con? Uh, it was something that we've seen. It's really big in Mexico and all that. We wanted to, to bring it here and make something fun and different. And uh, the beef you would be using local? Yes, yeah, exactly. We actually make a uh, coffee rub mm -hmm. uh, and we just slow roast it a little bit okay. just to get it on there and yeah, it's a very, it's one of my favorites for sure. Here we have our uh, beet pesto and goat cheese pizza topped with our local Bayada greens. Uh, it's a handmade crust that we make fresh daily. Uh, super thin crust and very delicious. It's so good that you get the sweetness of the beet. Mm -hmm. with that salty punch on the goat cheese is really nice. We are on our second last stop at Moncton's own tire shack. We have here Alan, who loves beer, right? You got it. The whole reason that we open this place is we want to create a sense of community, a space where anybody can come and feel welcome at any time. So what kind of inspiration do you guys use to develop the drinks? We like to brew with a lot of fruit. Uh, we like to use a lot of hops. What about this guy? This is a Secret Society Toasted Marshmallow Stout. This one's a really popular beer for us. And then we serve it with the toasted marshmallow as well to make it all come together. We try to encourage a lot of local businesses to come in and do kitchen pop-ups and get the community excited because it's a new space. We don't normally have food, so it's an exciting little extra that we can do on the weekends here that is really, uh, I think people really love it. Since morning, we have been eating all over the city. We started with some French pastries, we had some Malaysian food, we went to Sidiac for beautiful lobster 
and then we went to Houston Park and we finished our day at Tire Shack with some beautiful local beer. Right now, you are here at Clo and I'm gonna show you what I cook. What you have here is a sustainable blue salmon from Nova Scotia. Uh, it's uh, spiced with our own house blend of za'atar with some dill, charred jalapeno salsa, fresh pita, olive oil. You have a butcher's block here. It's 100% grass-fed organic beef, uh, which is simply seared, cooked on high heat, basted with butter, uh, a lot of herbs, thyme, and on top is finished with Newfoundland salt. And you have your vegetables. So you have your charred scallion, carrots, and sunchokes. <laughs> 